Yo, what's up? My name is Daniel Fleafield and welcome to Let Me Judge. In today's battle or in today's reaction, I will react to a female calisthenic battle from Wall of Bar Heroes. It's between Sveti Staneva and Lea de Pakniks. I don't know how to pronounce that. You know how, how I am with names. It was a long time since I reacted to a female calisthenic battle, so it's time. If you're new to the channel, I post reaction videos, tutorials and other stuff related to calisthenic and street workout. So consider subscribing if you like those type of videos. This will be an interesting battle because I've already commented on Sveti Staneva against uh, Vacher and this time it's Leah de, Pag de Pagnes there are two rounds, 45 seconds each, and the categories are dynamics, power dynamics, statics, combos, and creativity. Let's start the video. Okay, Sveti is starting. Oh, that was a good hold. Alright, you, Sveti, you have already improved from the last video I saw commented on you. I will give you points for that. It was a hold on the top, it was a hold at the bottom. It was not the cleanest form as you can have, but still, for the categories of females, there are not many females that are doing a full front lever. Good job. <laughs> Let's go. Well, I've told this before, yes, it's a attempt to Victorian, but for me, this is not a Victorian. It's like, it's too bent in the hips, more to an L-sit, in my opinion. This is something that she can work on. Maybe on her Instagram and social media, she is doing it much cleaner, but I am commenting on this competition. The transitions are so weird. And stand. Okay. Pull back lever. Okay, let's break down her round, what I think. Full front lever hold at the top, good. I'll count that as static points and also at the bottom. But uh, the Victorian, I would not count that. And for me, going from a Victorian and then going up in a weird way, like with the legs and then standing up to a handstand and not pressing up to a handstand. It's just, I don't know. There was not so much points after the front lever for me because she went to a handstand, held the handstand for a long time and then went down to a back lever and that's it. That's her, her whole round. So something she could work on, I've seen her like I've seen her battle before and this is something she did in the last battle as well. She could learn the press to handstand. That would give her so much more points, both in the combos, power dynamics. But let's see what Leia uh, has to offer. I know she's super tall if you compare it to Sveti. So let's go! Sveti. No, Sveti, Leia. Strada flash. I will not count that. Um. Two. Oh yeah. Let's go. Okay. 360. Nice one. Oh, dynamic muscle. Come on, come on. Oh, that's nice. Oh! Why not the 360? Okay, she's showing that she's closing her hands to a V-sit on the straight bar! Clean! That was her round. So, let's just go back in the beginning what she did. She did the planche. She was supposed to do the planche, but it wasn't a hold. Like, it was going up to that position and then just falling down. So, it was not a hold. It would not count as a static. A static move is at least two seconds. This is something I have not shared with you. Many people think that when they go out, it's like one, two. It doesn't count like that. Like, if I take the timer here and I press here, the clock starts from zero, not one. So it's zero, one, two. 
and too many athletes are counting in their head like yeah I went out so it's one two it doesn't count like that you need to count zero one two that is a tip and then going to that V sit it was almost a two second hole like but let's go to her straight bar combo doing that swing to 360 nice she didn't touch the floor she usually touch the floor when she does her dynamic stuff but she didn't do it here and then doing that transition to a dislocate from a swing like swing forward like 360 dislocate i don't know what what, what that move is called i i can do that but i don't know the name but then not completing it with a 360 is just ah oh, losing so much points like you are here you're meant to do a 360 i've told you told you guys this before that is something she can work on and then that visit hole was long enough it was clean and the back lever would not count because it, he said time like the time was already over but just from the first round uh, it's super hard to judge here because Leah did some dynamics and that Sveti didn't do that but I know Sveti is good at dynamics so let's see what she brings in the last round Let's go. 360. 2540! Nice! 540 again! Oh shit. Okay. Damn! Okay, so that's swing 360, 2540 was on point that's high level dynamics especially for the females not many females are doing that and then doing that 540 again nice one but then here swinging to a sw uh, 180 and then i think she's calling this ganger but after uh, analyzing this it's not a really a ganger because a ganger you need to do a flip here it's more as a twist like you can see the difference because you're like what what is that? Is that a Ginger? Is that 540? I would say the thing she does here, like in the last thing she do did here in the dynamic that she failed, that was a 540 but holding the arm longer than usual, holding it like a Ginger. But she's doing a twist and not a flip. A Ginger you need to do a flip and not a twist only. Okay, she's going. Muscle up. Front row. 360 Ah, knee giants Ass drag And then Drag on 360 Boom Everything she did in the second round was dynamics And those dynamics that she had was pretty high She would not get a lot in the combo points because she interrupted it with some with a fail and then swinging a lot like not coming up directly so the combo points will be lower in my opinion and remember this is let me judge so i'm judging from my chair at home okay now it's leah's turn and Svete is like she will win the, the dynamics leah didn't do so much dynamics and now she's doing she's going for the parallels and i understand that she needs to go for the parallels because she needs to show the var variety <laughs> Boom, walking up to a B sit. Hold up, one, two. Come on, come on, press up, press up. Oh no, wait. Let me go back again. Here she's the walking B sit. Almost holding it for two seconds. Then, then pressing up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. But then she fades. Damn. She's not holding everything. Can, Leah, just hold that for a bit longer. Well, let's go back again here in this move. Zero, one. It's not even two seconds. Come on, pressing up to a handstand. Damn, she was too tired. Nice one. A side, uh, I don't know what to call that. No. One last move, please. No, she's too tired. 
So the first one, the creativity of walking up to a VC nice. I don't know if she held it for two seconds, but still it was creative walking up. But then after that, when she wanted to press up to handstand, she failed. So that is no points. And then go into a one arm, I don't know what to call that. She didn't hold that long enough. So it would count as points. To be counted as static points, it needs to be at least two seconds. So what I would predict is that actually Svetu will win. It is not hard to see that she was more of a hybrid athlete doing also the statics like high level static like front lever hold at the top at the bottom and I will count the back lever as a static as well but much more than that she didn't do but that is higher Leah did a lot of visits in different places but that's it and the thing that Leah did well in the end I don't know why that one leg front lever pull up it doesn't count it doesn't give you points because it's a progression it's not a full move if you did a straddle front lever pull up that would be another thing yes yeah, Svete did win the statics the dynamics and the, and the strength dynamics Good job, really good job with the battle, with your round Sveti, it was good. Just work on the P-bars a little bit more, like you're starting really well with the front lever hold at the top and then going down and then going up to a Victoria. It, not, it is not clean because you're bending too much in your hips, so it's more towards an l -sit. People can say whatever they want, yeah, but she's a girl, she, that should count. But we are judging females and males like the same, it's, they don't have a handicap. But the overall round from Sveti was extremely good, like the dynamics, she can work on the flow a little bit more, like comb combining strength, like statics in her straight bar combos, that will give her a lot more points as well, and the judges will see that as well. But overall, a really good battle, Leah needs to work more on the dynamics part, she needs to, like, I, I think she has shrimp flip, she has other stuff, and when it's the finals, like you need to throw that stuff here. If you want to win, you need to risk it. Like you can't just, oh, I, I will stay safe. No, you need to do the things. If you know that you're competing against a girl like Sveti that is strong in the dynamics as well. Like you need to throw those crazy stuff that you know. But guys and girls, let me know in the comments what you thought about this battle. Does that Victorian count as a Victorian or not in my opinion it doesn't like static it is in, is it important to hold it at least two seconds or not let me know in the comments and if you're new to the channel subscribe if you like this video boom power up that like button and I will see you in the next video